Hi, I'm Natieli, and today's tutorial is this tiny French Bulldog Amigurumi keychain. This one is not in a, on a keychain. This one is. Uh, it's a no sewing needed pattern. We change colors here. It's not that difficult. I'm going to show you how to do it. And it's really cute and quick pattern. I also have other dogs. I have this weenie dog pattern. And it's also a keychain, really tiny. And the spug, in the similar size. And I'm doing other kinds of dogs also and releasing it. So if you uh, want to do a whole collection, subscribe. And if you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. So let's get started. I'm going to be using a 3 millimeters hook. And we're going to start by doing a magic ring. And six single crochets in it. One, two, three, four, five, six single crochets. Now we pull through. So that was the first round, and we finish it with six stitches. Now for round number two. I'm going to increase six times. So I'm going to do two single crochets in each stitch. One increase, two increases, three. Three, four, five, and six increases. So we finish here the second round with twelve stitches. Now we're going to start round number three. We're going to start by doing two single crochets. One, going through my marker here, one single crochet and two single crochets. Now we're going to do the tail. So we're going to chain three, one, two, and three. And we're going to come back here with two slip stitches. So one slip stitch here and on the next one slip stitch. Now we are back to the round. We're going to make uh, four single crochets. So we've got to be careful. This one was the left, the last one. So we come here on the next and we do one, two, three, and four single crochets. Now we're gonna do a popcorn stitch. So popcorn stitch, it's made with five double crochets on the same stitch. So one, two double crochet, three double crochet, four, and five all on the same stitch. I'll pull a little bit, come here on the first one, on the first double crochet, take this loop and pull through. Whoop. Almost lost it, the, the whole thing. So that's a popcorn stitch. You see, it looks like a popcorn. <laughs> now we're gonna do two single crochets, one and two. 
And now we're going to do another popcorn stitch, which is five double crochets together on the same stitch. So five double crochets, one, two, three, four, and five double crochets. We pull it, come here in the first double crochet, and pull through the loop. So we did here a popcorn stitch. Now we're gonna do two single crochets and finish this round. So one and two single crochet. So we finished this round, that was round number three with 12 stitches. Now for round number four, we're gonna do six single crochets. So one, two, so this is the tail so we don't crochet in it, we just keep it and we go back here normally. So three, four, five, six, six single crochets. Now we're gonna decrease three times. So we come here, gotta be careful with the stitches because they count. So here, one, decrease this is hard to do on camera because the camera is on my face basically so two decreases and three decreases so we finished this round that was round number four with nine stitches now we're gonna make two rounds, rounds number five and six with nine single crochets. So we're not gonna make any increases or decrease, just two rounds with nine single crochets. I'm gonna make mine and then you can make yours too and you pause the video and make yours and then we come back. So I made here my two rounds with nine single crochets, rounds five and six. Now I'm gonna do round number seven. So we're gonna start by doing, uh, we're gonna do actually two single crochets and one increase three times. So I already made one here and pulled through my marker. So one, two single crochets and one increase. One time, one, two single crochets and one increase two times and one two single crochets and one increase three times so I finished this round that was round number seven uh, with 12 stitches now for round round number eight we're gonna do 12 stitches which is, we're not gonna make any increases or decreases, we're just gonna make 12 single crochets. If, if you like my videos, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It's free for you, <laughs> but hopefully it will help me to monetize my channel. And don't forget to subscribe also. I am always posting new patterns so I appreciate that. So I got here by the end of the round uh, with 12 stitches. Now for round number nine, we're gonna do one single crochet and one increase six times. So one single crochet, I'm gonna pull my marker here. Now one increase, I'm gonna repeat that up to the end of our rounds. So one single crochet, one increase, one single crochet, one increase. And we're gonna repeat that. 
So my video is in English. Uh, I'm Brazilian and I also do, uh, we speak Portuguese in Brazil. <laughs> I also do Portuguese videos and English also, as you are seeing. So I would like to know where you are from. Uh, if you like to leave it out on the comments so I see where are people watching from. <laughs> Where are you from? Comment down below, please. It's really fun for me to see. There are people from all over the world watching. <laughs> uh, hopefully. Uh, so, now I finish here round number 9 with 18 stitches. For round number 10, we're going to make 18 single crochets. So, we're not going to make any increase or decrease. Just a round of single crochets. We're gonna do single crochets up to the marker. So I finished round number 10 with 18 stitches. Now I'm gonna start round number 11 with 13 stitches. I already made my first here. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirty. Now we're gonna make a popcorn stitch. So double crochets one, two, three. Four, and five double crochets come here in the first pull through now we're gonna make three single crochets so one two and three and I'm gonna finish our round with one more popcorn stitch. So one, two, three, four, and five. I'm gonna take this and pull through. So we finished this round, that was round number 11, with 18 stitches still. For round number 12, we're going to start by doing one single crochet, pulling the marker here. So one single crochet, now I'm going to decrease two times. So one. Oops, one and two. <laughs> Decreases. Now we're gonna increase four times. Gonna start doing the next. So one increase, two, three. and four so increase four times now i'm going to decrease two times so one decrease two decreases now i make one single crochet and two more decreases so one and two. So we finished this round. It was round number 12. We're gonna finish it with 16 stitches. Now for round 13, we're gonna start by doing two decreases. So one decrease. That's our first stitch. 
so two so one and two decreases now we're gonna increase six times so one increase two three four five and six six increases now I'm gonna decrease three times Oops. one two and three so we finished this round that was round 13 with 17 stitches now we're gonna stuff the body I'm gonna stuff mine then I come back stuff the body now I'm gonna start round 14 and in this round we're gonna start using the black color So now we're going to start round 14 with one decrease. So that's going to be my first stitch. So one decrease and one single crochet. in white one decrease one single crochet in the color white now I'm gonna start with the black yarn so I'm gonna show you how I do it so I'm gonna undo part of the stitch so you have two loops here from the previous stitch and that's how I introduce my yarn, the other color yarn. So I take here to the loop and then pull through. So I'm not counting stitches yet. I just finish with the other color. Now, I am going to make, we don't cut the, the white yarn because we're still going to use it. Um, now I'm going to make three single crochets in black. So one, two, and three single crochet. One increase. Three single crochets again. One two, three, one increase, and six single crochets, one, two, three, four, five, and six so it got here to our marker you can see that's where we started the the white yarn and now we're gonna uh, uh so we finish here round number 14 where we started with the black yarn and we finish it with 18 stitches now we're gonna start rounds round 15 and the entire round is going to be black, all black yarn, but we don't cut the white yet. I'm going to uh, tie a knot here between the white and the black so uh, it doesn't get lost and untied. So I'm going to tie like actually two knots. And now I'm going to start round number 15. So we're going to start doing seven single crochet. Round 15 is all in black. So seven 
one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Seven, a uh, single crochet. Now we're gonna make uh, the first ear. So in the first ear, let me see if I can show you. So we have two loops in the stitch. Black is not easy. <laughs> we have two loops in the stitch. Let's see if we focus. You see two loops. We're gonna take just the front loop here. You see just the front loop. We have two, but we're gonna take just the front loop. And we're gonna start doing and we're gonna do a group of stitches all in the same stitch uh, front loop here so we're gonna start by doing one slip stitch uh, in this front loop and then one half double crochet in the same stitch one double crochet in the same stitch one treble crochet in the same stitch all front loop a treble now another double crochet and half double crochet all in the same stitch and now a slip stitch so a finish here to do the first ear you see and it gets this tiny hole because of because we just using the front loop but here in the back we're still gonna be left with the back loop and for the next round we're gonna use it so I finish here the ear now we're gonna make three single crochets so we come here in the next stitch both loops normally I'm gonna do three single crochets so one two and three now I'm gonna make the second ear just like we did the first one so front loop only we're gonna do a slip stitch one half double crochet one double crochet one treble crochet oops one double crochet one half double crochet and one slip stitch all front loop only we made the second year now we're gonna finish the round by doing six single crochets all in black so we come here this is the front loop you see so in the next stitch we do one two, three, four, five, and six. So we got here to our marker, you see? That's our marker by the end of our rounds. That was round 15 where we did the ears. And I finished round 15 still with 18 stitches because we don't count the, the ears. So now for round 16, we're gonna do 18 single crochets in black. Uh, we're just gonna have to pay attention to the stitches behind the ear. So we come here and do one, let's see, one, I'm gonna start by marking with the black here. It's 18 single crochets, so we're not gonna make any increases or decreases. Just gotta remember the stitches behind the ear. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now I got you the ear. So I pull it back, find here the back loop, you see? I'm gonna do the eight one. 
the eight stitches. Now we're gonna do, we're gonna come here and do the three stitches between the ears. So eight, nine, ten, eleven. We got you the second year. So what we do is we pull the ear back, find here the back loop and we do one single crochet. Now we go back here and keep doing it. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So we did here the 18 stitches without making any increases, but the difference is we did here the single crochets that were hidden behind the ear. So now we finish here round number 16, still with 18 single crochets, 18 stitches. So now we're gonna start the round where we have this color change, the forehead. So what we're gonna do we're gonna be changing the colors all the time. I already did my first stitch here and put through my marker. We're gonna start by doing eight single crochets in black. So I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and now the, the last one, the eight one. I just do like halfway. What I would do is I would yarn over and pull through these two loops. But since I'm gonna change the color, what I do is I come through the stitch and I have these two loops and I yarn over with the white and pull through with the white. So we have here eight stitches in black now we're gonna make three stitches in white. So one, two, and the third one, we're gonna do it the same way. I'm gonna leave the two loops here and then take the black yarn and pull through the two loops. So I did eight in black, three in white. Now we're gonna finish with seven in black. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So we finish here uh, round number 17 with 18 stitches. Still, but eight in black, three in white, and seven in black. Now for round 18, we're gonna start by doing five single crochets, one decrease, and one single crochet in black. So five single crochets in black. So one, two, three, four, and five single crochets. Now I'm gonna do one decrease. And the last one, like I told you, we do halfway change for white. So now what we're gonna do in white is uh, we're gonna do one decrease. You see? and one single crochet that I'm gonna do halfway only, like I told you, and chain with the black. So one decrease and one single crochet in white. Now we're gonna finish this round uh, with one single crochet, one decrease, and four single crochets. So one single crochet, one decrease, and four single crochets, so one, two, three, and four. So that was round number 18, and we finish it with 15 stitches. 
Now we're gonna start round number 19. We're gonna start by doing three single crochets uh, and two decreases in black. So one, two, three single crochet and two decreases in black. So one decrease, I'm gonna make it completely. The second one, I do just halfway. So halfway to decrease, we pull through. Now the second one, I pull through with the white one. And now uh, we're gonna make two single crochets in white. So one and two but the second one halfway i guess you uh, i hope you get by now how i work the color change so i pull through and now we're going to finish round 19 by doing two decreases and two single crochets in black so two decreases one and two decreases and now two single crochets so one and two Now we finish then round number 19 with 11 stitches. Now we're going to go for round number 20. We're going to start round number 20 with two single crochets in black. So one. And two. Now we're gonna change for white. And we're gonna finish with uh, white now. We're gonna do three single crochets. Let me check. Three single crochets. So one, two, and three. Three single crochets. One decrease. and four single crochets. One, two, three, and four. So we get here to the marker, you see? And we finish round number 20 with 10 stitches. Now for rounds, for round 21, we're gonna make 10 stitches in white. All in white. Here we can cut the black yarn already. Uh, we, we have to leave a long tail so we can sew the nose. And so we leave like a long tail with black. And now we're gonna do 10 stitches in white. That's gonna be round 21. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. 10 stitches. So we we'll finish round 21 with uh, 10 stitches. Now for round 22, we're gonna do just halfway. We're gonna do four single crochets, but here we have our two loops. We're gonna be taking just the back loop. Oh, let me show you closer. So we have here two loops. We're gonna do four single crochets, taking only the back loop here. You see? this one behind, not the one in the front. So we're gonna do that. I'm gonna try to show you. So here we're gonna do one single crochet, back loop only, two single crochets, back loop only, three single crochets, back loop only, and four single crochet, back loop only. So we, we are left with this 
uh, line here. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna leave a long tail uh, with the white to close it up. Now we're gonna place the safety eyes. So for this size of uh, hook, I and yarn, I am using a seven millimeters eye safety eye. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come right here on this dent and we're gonna place our eyes in it. Like here, it's tight. <laughs> You see, now on the other other side, the same place like this corner here. Now I'm gonna put the safety lock and gonna stop the head. And then I come back to show you how to close it up. So now what we're gonna do is, we're gonna close it like this. So we're gonna come here like that in the stitches and go this way and then the other way around. And again, hope you guys can see well. Now here, you see? Now we're gonna do the, the way again, inverse, through all the stitches. Now I'm gonna come here in a random place. Gonna tie a knot. Leaving a loop like this, pull through. Now I'm gonna come here and come here in the neck. And with this yarn, I am gonna sew in uh, the keychain thing. So I'm gonna come here with this yarn and sew in the keychain. I come here through the through the chain and go through the neck like in this one like I did this in this one you see so I go through here and again tie a knot Tie a knot again, so it gets really secure, and I'm gonna lose the yarn. You see? So now the long black yarn we leave it. We're gonna do the nose. We're almost there, so I'm gonna come here inside, and then. You can see in this one that in the middle of it, I do the nose. So I'm gonna come here through, let me show you, through this one, like the, right in the middle. Then I come with the black yarn. Now, I go on top, you see, on, on the top round, like that pull through now again you see i'm gonna come here and do like a v a v shape for started and now i'm gonna keep doing it i'm gonna hold it
And again, up to get like all black. Be hard. Because you gotta go through the middle of the stitches you see and now I'm gonna lose the yarn here so there you have it gotta fix the way <laughs> as we crochet it gets all cranked up and now I am gonna Fast enough here and cut all this yarn. So there you have it. Our French Bulldog is ready. Look at this. <laughs> so cute. The tone is a little bit different because I use different yarns in each one of them. But there you go. So if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you want to give any compliments on the comments, I will not refuse. <laughs> And if you have any doubts, you can also leave it in the comments. I read all of them. Thank you for watching. And see you next time. Bye-bye.